Well, we did this study to see if nitrates help patients who have a certain type of heart failure uh, due to a stiff heart called heart failure with preserved ejection fraction to see if nitrates could help these patients be more active. About six million people in the United States now have heart failure. Half of those have this special type of heart failure where the heart is stiff uh, and causes problems with the ability to be active and to tolerate activity. So it's a pretty big problem. What we found is that during the time the patients were taking nitrates, they were actually less active than when they were taking the placebo medicine. Further, we found that when they were taking the nitrate, they didn't have better performance on an exercise test, and they didn't have better symptoms as assessed by a symptom score that assesses heart failure symptoms. Physicians frequently treat these types of heart failure patients with nitrates to try and help them feel better. I think what we found is that probably due to some subtle side effects of the nitrates, patients were less active and they weren't able to tolerate activity better. Uh, so I will not be prescribing nitrates uh, to help with symptoms for this specific type of heart failure. The other important thing about this study is that for the first time in this type of study, we actually used uh, accelerometers, patient-worn devices that tell us what's going on with the patient at home on their daily activities. Typically, we bring research patients in and have them do exercise tests or all sorts of special tests, but it's probably better to actually see what the medicine is doing uh, on a daily basis. So I think uh, this may be the start of using patient-worn devices in clinical practice and research studies to really find out what we're, how what we're doing affects their daily lives.